Now what I'm about to say is going to be kind of hard. Some people aren't going to like it. But I'm going to say it anyway. Because I believe today that there's a lot of people in the so-called Christian church that need to hear it. If we cannot or are not willing to submit ourselves to the will and plan of God for us, we have no business identifying ourselves as Christians. If you're out there and you're trying everything in your power to get God to follow you and to bless your endeavors and to bless your plans and to bless what you've decided you want to do and make you what you've decided you want to be and achieve what you've decided you want to achieve, you have no business calling yourself a Christian because, honey, you are so far from what a Christian is supposed to be, it's not even funny. You're supposed to be carrying a cross, not handing the Lord your cross and saying, here, Lord, here's the custom-made cross that I've created. You can carry it for me, Lord. Allowing our own thoughts, our own plans, our own desires, our own will to dictate how we live our lives. All the while broadcasting to the world that we're believers. We're born again Christians. I live on my terms. I pursue my own way. I do things according to my own will, but I'm a Christian. No, you're not, baby. So quit calling yourself one because you're jacking up the image of the church before the world. You're destroying, in front of the world, you're destroying the testimony of God's true church. Right. So you better quit. God, I'm going to tell you, hell's hot and heaven's real. And these people think playing games with God this way is going to end well in the judgment. And I've got news for you today. It will not end well. The unprofitable servant shared the same end as those who had never uh, believed and never obeyed the gospel. He was cast into outer darkness with her sweeping and gnashing of teeth. Got news for you, honey. When you claim to be a child of God, but you refuse to do things God's way, you better not think for one minute that you've got heaven secured. Pastor, you're not supposed to preach that straight. Oh, yes, I am. Oh, yes, I am. I know my calling. Don't tell me my calling. 